in case of a hard Brexit, um, I'm, I'm afraid there's going to be additional problems uh, in trying to find a PhD opportunity here. Uh, fortunately, this university is trying its best to, to, to uh, give opportunities to students from Europe, but at this, at, at this very moment it seems like well, the, the priorities are well, basically trying to make the government agree on something, anything. <laughs> Um, just the uncertainty of it all, so like we don't really know how it affects because I'm doing a year abroad, so I don't know how it affects me in terms of like health and stuff that we're, like we're protected by the EU in that way, so I don't know. My main concern is about getting a job as a student, for example, after Brexit happens, because I'm, it's still not exactly uh, clarified um, if I'm going to have to get an NI number or if I'm going to have to show proof or if I'll have to get a visa to work. And it's important for me to be able to support myself as a student later on. If we do leave the EU, I won't be able to just go and study there, go and work there. I think it's very much um, a wasted opportunity if we do leave. And I, yeah, I very much don't want to leave. There's an uncertainty about what's going to happen when we leave, what's going to happen to students studying here, what's going to happen to European students if they want to come here to the UK. And it's just, it's just very, very confusing at the moment. And I think that's placed a lot of um, anxiety for students on campus, but also a lot of European students as well who had plans to come to the UK mm -hmm. or UK students who had plans to go and study and work in Europe as well. I think that um, the free travel and the free movement, especially working in different countries, gave a lot of students like the opportunity to expand their, mm -hmm. their knowledge, their experience, as well as gaining some, something else from another culture. So I think they're going to lose a lot of that um, because of whatever is going to come from Brexit, as well as what Omolade said, because there's no certainty. Nobody knows what what benefits or what, yeah. um, what are outcomes. They losing, exactly. So yeah. I think it's going to be a very... It's going to be a shame. We are potentially moving into a situation, if we have no deal, that those students who could have come here as part of the EU uh, structure of Erasmus exchanges will no longer be able to come. They will move into the bracket of international students, not part of the EU uh, home UK student body. And that will potentially have a fee implication. It will may also have visa implications in terms of access to the, the, the systems that we have here and, and health and support. We, we Again, the system is unclear and until we have a clear position from our government and from the EU, that will re remain uh, unclear. <laughs>